This episode of Video Gamers Oasis Play Theater is brought to you by Feature Points, Get Free Gift Cards, Games, and much more. Try free apps, get rewards. Go to your iOS or Android browsers and type HTTP colon forward slash forward slash F E A T U dot R E forward slash V G O. Use the app, start reaping the rewards. Gamers, welcome back to my gaming channel, Video Gamers Oasis Play Theater. I'm your host, the one, the only, the lovable, huggable Meat Geek. With another episode of Ben Jordan Paranormal Investigator, case number six. Scourge of the Sea People. We're going to continue our adventure with our hero, Ben Jordan, and he's on the, uh, on hot on a trail of some supernatural underwater amphibian men, people, whatever they are, in Greek, in Egea Anna, in Greece. Before I begin, will you join me for some milk and cookies? Right here. Some milk, a little bit of cookies, chocolate chip cookies, by the way. Mmm. 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 A bit more calcium in my diet. Before I begin, also, I haven't had enough of the cookies. I've been cleaning my room all day, organizing, getting rid of junk. Actually, taking advice of, of, uh, of um, a certain other Jordan. He's been giving me some good advice on his YouTube videos about clean your room. Well, I'm doing it. So let's continue our adventure. <coughs> Beach. <coughs> let's continue on. So we're at the beach now. Ba 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 ba. Ba 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 ba. Okay, so we're in the game. Let's continue on. We've talked to everyone we could talk to. Quincy Sanborn, has any questions? Could I interrupt you guys for a minute? No problem, Mike. What's up? I'll just get on with what I was doing. Good luck, Mr. Jordan. Remember, we're here if you need anything. Alright, we've talked every to everybody we could in this area. Uh, someone, someone had, so two campers had were dragged underwater. We're gonna find the sea people, the location of sea people, solve this mystery. Let's go to, let's go to this uh, with the pizza restaurant, see if we can talk to anybody. Let's talk to the pizza lady. Could I talk to you for a minute? What do you want? Missing campers. Have you heard? Two campers are missing. I think they may have been taken by the sea people. But I got more. They will kill us all. Stop asking about them. Fine, sorry. See you later. Goodbye. Anything else to say? So how's business? Eh, you ask strange questions. Save our progress. And we'll save it as campers because we're tracking down these. What happened to these campers by the beach? They were dragged underwater, perhaps by the sea people. We're gonna find out a solution to our issue or mystery. Let's go to this to the bar. Okay, there's a lady selling flowers. Old woman. The this old woman seems to have claimed corner of the bar for her own. It appears she's selling flowers. Nice flowers you got there. You want to buy you want to buy my flowers? Oh no thanks. I was just looking. Excuse me. Flowers. I sell flowers. You want flowers? No, I was wondering if I could ask you some questions. Okay questions. Then you buy flowers. Tell me about yourself. 
Me, I sell flowers. What else is there to know? Flowers? What can you tell me about flowers? I know many things about many flowers. What do you want to know? I'm not really sure, but I guess I know who to come to if I have any floral needs. Yes, you come to me to buy flowers. Uh, tell me, Igia Anna. What do you know about Igia Anna? Nice village, many beautiful flowers here and in the area. Anything else aside from the flora? <coughs> no. Sea people. Have you heard of the sea people? Sea people? Yeah, they're also called the foresides. Ay! The old woman begins spitting in your general direction. What the? Patooey! Patooey! Okay, okay, I forgot. I, I forget to ask. Jeez, everyone's so sensitive around here. I have to go. Flowers! Buy some flowers! Alright, alright. What can I buy with? Flower basket. A medium sized woman basket. woven basket full of flowers is on the table. There doesn't seem to be much selection. You can't just take the flowers without buying them. Anyway, none of them look very appealing to you. Well, this, well, what about this flower? It's a pretty flower. You have no idea what kind it is, though. What's this one? It's a pretty flower. You have no idea where it is. Okay. Let's try both of these flowers. Get both of her. What can you tell me about this flower? This is Asphodel. It grows in Hades and it is the favorite food that they did. Pleasant. Thanks for your info. How about the other one? What can you tell me about this flower? Ah, this is Chrysanthemum. It is a symbolic of death. Right, thanks for that. Okay, well, let's save this as flower lady. What else can we uh, give this woman? How about this map? You don't want to give her your stuff later anyway. You may need it later. Nice flowers you got there. You want to buy some flowers? Uh, no, I'm not just I'm just looking. Excuse me. Flowers. I sell flowers. You want flowers? No, I was wondering if I could ask you some questions. Okay, questions. Then you buy flowers. I have to go. Flowers. Buy some flowers. What can I give this lady? To uh, Professor Sanborn, Simon, and Alice. <coughs> Can I interrupt you guys for a minute? No bomb, Mike. What's up? I'll just get on with what I was doing. Good luck, Mr. Jordan. I remember we're here if you need anything. Okay. Fisherman's house. What's this? Mesh. The mesh lining has been cut open and now hangs from the empty box. You easily remove the mesh from the box's frame. The box formerly contained tentacles and is now empty. Small piece of mesh. It smells faintly of baked seafood.
mesh feels thick and sturdy. Save our progress as fishermen. <coughs> You knock on the door. Para que lo permiti en el lipto. Oh, it's you. Come in. How can I help you? Let's give him the mesh. You don't want to give your stuff away just maybe later, okay? Let's ask him a question. Can I ask you some questions? This is what you came here for, so go ahead. Ah, sea people. Did you hear? The sea people took some campers last night. Yes, I did hear. Not only did they take the campers, they took the tentacles I had outside of my house. Did you know how difficult it is to catch an octopus? Not really. It is difficult. They blend in very well with the scenery. But I am sure you don't care about this. We need to worry about the sea people. I don't suppose you have made any progress in this matter. Underwater. I'd like to go sailing again. And let us go. I didn't mean to press that. I wanted to ask him a question about underwater. Maybe I can ask him on the boat. Hey, Captain! What is it? I want to ask you a few things. I'm listening. Chart a course. I think it's time we plot a course. Excellent idea. Where do you want to go? Hmm. Lair of the uh, Sea People. How about we check out the Sea People's Lair? You got it. Okay, here we are. I hope you know what you're doing. Ask him a question. I want to ask you a few things. I'm listening. That's, uh, try to course. Because I'm going plot a course. Excellent. Where do you want to go? Back to Ege Anna. We go back to Ege Anna. I think I'm starting to get seasick. We're almost nearing our mission. The pub bus will take us back. Okay, we're back. I'm going home. If you want to go sailing again, come see me. I wanted to ask him a question. I didn't get to uh, ask the question. For some reason, they won't let me ask the question on the boat. Go back into his house. You knock on the door. Palacala permette en el lepto. Oh, it's you. Come in. How can I help you? Can I ask you some questions? This is what you gave me for, so go ahead. Underwater. I still have to figure out how to get underwater so I can get to the sea people's lair. As I told you, I have no diving equipment, nor does anyone in the village. Perhaps you should ask the Oracle. Yeah, I think that might be my only option. All right. I'd like to go sailing again. Then let us go. Finally, we're on, on the right track. Hey, Captain! What is it? I want to ask you a few things. I'm listening. Chart a course. I think it's time you plot a course. Excellent idea. Where do you want to go? Oracle Island. How about we check out the island with the Oracle? Sure thing. Already made it. Good. 
Let's look at our water, see if we have enough. It's the, the cup is now full of distilled fresh water. <coughs> the cup feels like ceramic. Okay, good. Let's save our progress. Oracle Island. All right, excellent. We have to summon the oracle again. In the corner is a large stone statue depicting three women in robes. The three fates, maybe. Let's pour it on the statue. You pour some fresh water onto the statue. <clears throat> Once again, you have summoned me. Tell me what knowledge it is you would seek to gain. Question. I have some questions for you, Oracle. Then ask them. Sea People's Lair. I found the Sea People's Lair. What am I supposed to do now? The Sea People are ruled by a king. If you seek out and destroy this king, the rest will perish. Thus, you will end the scourge of the Sea People. That sounds pretty easy, almost too easy underwater. There's one little problem I seem to have run across. How am I supposed to go underwater? Nobody in the village has any diving equipment. You will need to take a special potion which will allow you to breathe underwater for a period of time. Only then will you be able to seek out the king of the sea people. Potion. Okay, so where do I get some of this magical potion? You will need to bring me two ingredients. The first is an iris flower, named for the messenger of the gods, the very rainbow herself. The nectar from the iris will allow you to travel through the sea, as she did. Next, you must bring me the scale of a siren. Do these things actually exist? Yes, beware their song for they will lead you to your doom. Bring me these items and I shall make you the potion to breathe underwater. Sounds like a deal. That's all for now. May the fates guide you on your journey. Save our progress as Oracle Cave. Let's get it move on. The board is going to hang on back to the door. Alright, we're going to find a siren. Hey, Captain. What is it? I want to ask you a few things. I'm listening. Sirens. Do you know anything about sirens? Ah, yes, another old sea legend. Quite a famous one, too. They are beautiful women who sing songs which attract sailors. However, when the sailors get too close, the siren reveals its true form and eats the poor fool. Uh, you don't suppose they really exist, do you? I don't think so. Why? The oracles told me I needed a siren scale. Oh, 
You notice the fisherman's expression changed slightly. Once many years ago, I thought I heard a strange yet beautiful song when I was out fishing. Do you remember where it was? Yes, it was near a small island to the northeast. A very small island. I see. Chart a course. I think it's time we plot a course. Excellent idea. Where do you want to go? Siren Island. Could you take me to the, s to the island where you heard the siren song? You're a lot braver than you look. I gotta tell you. Where in the distance you hear a beautiful voice. It piques your curiosity. Save our progress. Okay. Siren. Island.